Ladies and gentlemen, tonight the University of Wisconsin celebrates the achievements of a true Badger legend, the man most responsible for establishing the Wisconsin hockey program, Bob Johnson. Please direct your attention to the video board for a special presentation. After reinstating the program three seasons earlier following a 28-year hiatus, the University of Wisconsin named Bob Johnson its head hockey coach on April 1st, 1966. Wisconsin hockey would never be the same. Johnson's leadership was immediately felt as he led the Badgers to their first ever conference title in 1970 and first ever Frozen Four appearances in 1970 and 1972. The following season saw Johnson guide the Badgers to unprecedented heights with a 4-2 decision over top-ranked Denver in the 1973 national title game. It was the program's first ever national championship. Success continued for the Badgers under Johnson. After a year serving as U.S. Olympic coach, he returned to Madison to lead one of the finest seasons in college hockey history. The Badgers won a school record 37 times, capped by a dramatic 6-5 overtime win over Michigan in the 1977 National Championship game for Wisconsin's second national title. After a fifth Frozen Four appearance in 1978, Johnson led the backdoor Badgers to the mountaintop again in 1981. Grabbing the last at-large berth into the tournament, Johnson guided Wisconsin through the field, culminating with a 6-3 win over top-ranked Minnesota in the national championship game. It was Wisconsin's third national title under Johnson. Following the 1982 season, Johnson left Wisconsin to coach in the NHL with the Calgary Flames. He ultimately led Pittsburgh to a Stanley Cup championship as head coach of the Penguins. It was a position he held until his passing in 1991. The hockey world has not seen a coach like him since. 11 All-Americans, 10 Olympians, 22 players in the NHL, seven conference titles, seven Frozen Four appearances, three national championships, teacher, mentor, champion. Put simply, Bob Johnson is one of the most successful coaches of all time and an American sports icon. This exceptional man has earned an exceptional honor. It is with great pride and gratitude that the University of Wisconsin declares that from this day forward, the ice sheet at the Kohl Center, the home ice of the program he built, will forever be known as the Bob Johnson Rink. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the ice Bob and Martha Johnson's children and their families. Daughter Sandy and husband Tim McConnell and their family. Son Peter and his children. Daughter Julie Johnson Bird. And son Mark, wife Leslie and their family. Speaking on behalf of the Johnson family, please welcome Mark Johnson. Thank you very much on behalf of all my family members here on the ice, uh, but most importantly, uh, my mother Martha, who unfortunately got sick and was unable, unable to attend to tonight's uh, festivals. Uh, we all want to thank you for this wonderful honor and certainly this special night. I think a lot of players that played for my father learned a great deal as they walked through their four or five years in Madison and the experiences they got were something that they carry on the rest of their lives. And what the meaning of tonight means to the entire family is that my dad's memory will now live on forever. So whether you're young, whether you're old, whether you're some of the former players, the new players, or the future players, as people enter the Cole Center and they look down on the rink and they see my dad's name, his legacy will live on. So on behalf of my family, a, a big thanks to Barry Alvarez and the athletic department to Steve Alley and the group of alumni and donors that made this night possible, to Sean Fraser, who had a big role in getting this uh, evening on behalf of my father. A special thank you and good luck tonight to the Badger hockey team. Ladies and gentlemen, how about a big hand for the Johnson family?